What's up guys, this is Pew the Night Guest BOG, coming at y'all with a new collection video. As you remember last time, my shoes were on these stairs and they just went up uh, from the bottom to the top. This time I've uh, rearranged the shoes, so we're going to get it started with my everyday wear shoes. First off we have my Tiffany Janowskis, neon Air Max 95s, infrared 90s, one of the best Air Maxes ever made, if not the best skated original Janowskis white patent leather Janowskis got those white and black Chuck T highs and you gotta, gotta keep it classy with the Sperry's you know what I'm saying unless you look gotta keep that swag on lock so those are the everyday shoes uh, <clears throat> I'm gonna do a little bit for sale also Phenom size 10 Zoom Velocis size 10 Tiffany uh, black and red True Flight size 10 some Air Max size 10, Van Skate High size 10, Bowser Low size 10, Lost size 10 and a half, and uh, Neon size 10 and a half. Uh, check my ISS listings. I'll post the link uh, in the description. But let's get into the rest. So these are the shoes that you probably wouldn't expect to see in a collector's uh, collection. These are size 9 Cole Haan Air Jarvis. These are actually. Cole Haan is a dress shoe company owned by Nike, and these have the Nike Air Max technology in there. It's super comfortable. We have the Hyper Dunk 2010s, the Lunar Foam. We have Nike golf shoes. Everything I wear is Nike or owned by Nike. We have some old Hyper Rises. We have some Lunar Lights. All right, so let's get into the SBs and the real collection. We have the Death Sox Space Tigers. We have the Purple Rains, Angels and Demons, Venom Highs, Guns and Roses Lows. Here's the skated shoes. We got the Gucci P Rods. We have the uh, Newcastles and the Poisons. Here's some uh, other shoes. We have the Hundreds, Johnson Mids, Gourmets, Quattros, and uh, we have the Money Cat Highs. We have the Weir Lows. I remember when those were my favorite shoes of all time. I bought from Flight Club. Let's get into the blue boxes. One of my favorite SB highs of all time, believe it or not. Uh, I like to call them the Waterburger highs because Waterburger is amazing for all these southern people that know. We have the Chrome Ball Lows. Skunk Highs, amazing release. And we have the Bruce Springsteen Born in the USA. As you can see, I got that flag in there sick shoe. We have the Sport Red Blazers, amazing shoe. And the Fish Harbors, very underrated. Now let's get into the, my small but uh, meaningful Jordan collection. We have the Aqua 8s, the CDP 3s. Uh, these are actually size 9.5. I need a 10. I'll add cash, like quite a bit, to good condition 01s. If anybody has them, hit me up on ISS or YouTube. Uh, we have the Carmine Sixes, no OG box, but a uh, six shoe. Shout out to the Reels, those are his favorite Jordans. And we have the Chicago Bulls Sixes. These are very premium leather for uh, recent Jordan releases. Love those. Now let's get into the real heat. So, uh, Kawich called this his uh, Ring of Fire. I'm going to call this the Couch of Fire. Because uh, the ring would be a little bit too big, so let's get started with the Orange Box, S box SBs released in 2002. Got the Flashes. My most recent pickup, we have the Heinekens. So we have the Huff Highs. And we have some Sea Crystals. Here we go to the VNDS Tiffany's. Got my Zengrayer Yeezys, my Net Nets, other Zengrays, and then finally, last but not least, my Deadstock Tiffany's. Still my most prized possession. <laughs> See how I treat them. So uh, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and uh, post a video response with your collection. Uh, See what the sneaker community is doing on YouTube. So I hope you like this. Peace out, YouTube.